PAOB obtained its virtual bank license in May 2019 and have been providing banking services to retail and SME customers in Hong Kong since September 2020. We are very excited about the opportunities arising from the Guangdong, Hong Kong, Macau, Greater Bay Area Development Programme, and we are actively preparing ourselves to better serve our existing and potential customers as Hong Kong continues to integrate into mainland China's national development. As a virtual bank, we do not have any physical branches in Hong Kong or mainland China. As a result, PAOB has digitalized the customer journey starting with remote onboarding. We use technologies such as eKYC to ensure that we can properly perform our AML screening. One important component of AML review is name screening. Existing name screening solutions mainly cater for English and European names and words. In Hong Kong, and especially in mainland China, however, names of individuals and companies may only contain Chinese characters. As we know, unlike other Latin root languages, Chinese words are structured very differently. Name screening solutions, which use pinyin alone, often lead to a lot of false positives and increase the workload of our AML team tremendously. We have therefore been searching for solutions which offer Eastern and Western capabilities and which can handle both traditional English-centric and Chinese characters for name screening purposes. A solution that incorporates NLP or native language processing can help smoothen the digital onboarding process for our customers and can also help our AML team to fine tune our existing AML screening so that the results of our name checks are more accurate. And from there, we can get more insights and get a better understanding of our customers. As PLB suggested, the desired solution should offer both Eastern and Western capabilities. The objective is to provide higher quality alerts in the first place, helping banks to generate more business and lower compliance cost using a risk-based approach. Arif's self-invented, self-developed patent technology can help fill the gap with higher quality alerts by incorporating fuzzy logic to Chinese character natively, solving difficulties of Chinese character intricacy complementary to the existing English-centric AML, CFT screening and assessment systems in the market. Our core technologies incorporate several matching types, such as similar shapes, similar pronunciation, similar meaning for the Chinese characters NLP-based fuzzy logic handling to ensure screening effectiveness. In order to tackle the pain points of providing both Western and Eastern capabilities for PAOB's AML review, our product E2AML leverages our patented technology to assess PAOB's both English and Chinese characters fuzzy logic capabilities natively in the name screening systems. We also provide both English and Chinese character peer comparison capabilities to allow PAOB to benchmark the name and transaction screening system performance against their peers. We also provide false positive analysis natively to help PAOB understand the distribution of true or false alert by match name in both English and Chinese characters. We also provide a threshold analyzer for PAOB to run the same test iteratively with different threshold settings so that the optimal threshold tuning can be obtained for enhancing PAOB's existing name screening system performance. Ultimately, assessment reports can be generated on the fly for internal audit and regulator on-site inspection. We are delighted to cooperate with Arive. Our AML team found that the NLP-based Chinese character screening and assessment tool is very easy to use and help us improve on our existing name screening process by making it more effective and efficient with fewer false positive alerts. 
Using RegTech tools like this one reduces the time that our AML analysts need to spend on low-level but very time-consuming work. Mundane and routine check work is often found to be a common cause for human fatigue, and that in turn increases the risk of human error. Our colleagues can now channel their time and energy for reviewing higher value cases, and this helps to drive better staff morale. Besides, the use of RegTech tools help us cultivate a sense of innovation within our workforce, and this is very useful given the speed of technological advance in the financial industry. The successful collaboration with Arive helps us lay out the roadmap for ongoing AML performance improvement and RegTech adoption for our GBA initiatives. Riding on the trial results, we will continue to refine our screening process using a risk-based approach. And we hope to be able to extend its use to transaction monitoring and periodic review going forward. On this note, we would express our thanks to HKMA again for taking the lead to promote FinTech and RegTech adoption through the FinTech Supervisory Sandbox Program, without which banks like us may find it very difficult to partner with Arive or other smaller sized tech firms in conducting pilot trials for our FinTech and RegTech initiatives. As mentioned by PAOB, in addition to E2 AML screening testing and assessment solution, we apply our patented technology to the actual name screening system called E2 KYC, which offers both native base and transliteration-based screening of English, Chinese, and other non-Latin characters. Moreover, we add a Chinese character-centric adverse media of news and social media, cross-boundary KYC of Chinese residents through Greater Bay Area cross-boundary data mutual recognition platform under the approval of the mainland China Nansha government and cross-boundary KYC of mainland Chinese companies. This enables banks in Hong Kong to fulfill the KYC requirements and enhance cross-boundary financial services for individual mainland Chinese residents and companies. We also integrate additional technology such as optical character recognition, OCR, unstructured data business analytics through article screening, customer risk assessment, and institutional risk assessment, etc. We strongly believe the combination of AREVs, E2 AML and E2 KYC, not only helps promote the stability and integrity of the financial system, but also improve effectiveness and efficiency of banks' name screening process and support the bank's gatekeeper role in the AML ecosystem, consisting of government bureau, regulators, as well as law enforcement agencies. It can also benefit the wider public, such as the bank customers, as it will facilitate the processing of the opening of bank accounts. Innovation and strict compliance are two of PAOB's core values, and we are definitely going to adopt more RegTech solutions that will help us manage financial crime risks. We see a lot of opportunities arising with the rollout of open banking, since we will have better access to data from our customers with their consent. In addition to NLP, we are also looking into the use of AI, which is another widely adopted element in open banking. At PAOB, we look at RegTech beyond a compliance mindset, but see it as a differentiator to business success. We believe the use of AI, big data, and even blockchain will enable PAOB to provide even more efficient and effective services to our customers. While at the same time, the insights we gain from RegTech will put us in a position to early detect, assess, and prevent financial crimes. Thank, Thank you. you.